Uh, hey guys, this is Atul from Team K Tonic Academy, and in this video, uh, video I'm going to talk about what you can expect in this Cloud for Beginners uh, class that uh, I'll be holding or we'll be ha having shortly. Now, this is for complete beginner, and if you, even if you're working on cloud, maybe you might pick up a couple of things, but just to see whether you're right fit for this or not, and even to attend this, um, and if you have any questions on this. So we'll begin with, first of all, cloud, what and why. So we'll talk about traditional architecture in terms of what are the pro problems encountered with the traditional architecture, and what exactly this cloud, uh, cloud um, computing is, because of which, or these problems, why this um, cloud became so famous. We'll also talk about the common characteristics or properties of cloud, and the common things that you should be aware. So things like high availability, disaster recovery, fault tolerance, elasticity, scalability, and difference between elasticity and scalability. And these sounds might easy and simple. And if you're already working into IT, a lot of these things you should be you should already know. But if you're going for a certification, foundation level certifications like AWS Cloud Foundation, AWS um, uh, AWS for Beginners certification or Azure or Oracle or Google, you will come across these questions as well. And these are good for knowing about from a basic, when you're talking in terms of normal day-to-day -day operations as well. We'll also talk about CapEx versus OpEx differences, and we'll do some lesson quiz to see whether you understood these things or not as well. Then we'll look at cloud service model. This is, I think, the first important thing that you should be talking about, or you should be knowing. So difference between, um, we've just introduced this cloud service pyramid, um, and in terms of what all things uh, you should know uh, from a service model point of view, infrastructure as a service, platform as a service, and software as a service. We'll give you some examples from AWS, different services. Uh, we'll also do difference from Azure, in, in IS and PaaS examples, or from Oracle Cloud as well as IS, PaaS, and SaaS as well. And we'll again, we'll go deeper into these IS and PaaS as we go move forward on more advanced topics on, as, as, on, on the cloud. We'll also do the simple quiz, and then we'll also look at shared responsibility model, which is very important, especially when you're going for uh, security-related stuff, who does what in cloud, what is the responsibility of cloud vendor, and what your responsibility as, as a um, as an implementer or as someone who is managing the cloud. Then we'll go to the second important topic, which is uh, the deployment model, which is public, private, and hybrid, uh, these three models. So um, we'll also look at some of the private uh, um, cloud implementations or from AWS, which is Outpost, uh, from Azure, which is uh, Azure Stack Hub, from Google, as well as Oracle, which is Oracle term, it as a clouded customer, and we'll do the same, same some quiz to see whether you understood these concepts or not. We'll also briefly touch base with single versus multi-cloud, but as we go forward, we'll go multi-cloud later more in details as well. Then we'll also talk about the there are multiple cloud options, so which cloud you should be booking uh, based on your background and your situation. We'll talk about that. What are the cloud vendors available right now in the market? and which cloud stands where based on their customer uptake as well. Um, we'll also look back some of the common uh, services used and what are the appropriate names for these common services on each of these cloud, AWS, Azure, Google, Oracle. Uh, we'll also ask you to fill a quiz um, so that it'll help us to understand. And then once we know the basics of cloud, then we are going to go on to the next path, which is about uh, one of these AWS cloud, Azure cloud, Google cloud, and Oracle cloud, but that's next class. Um, so, uh, let me know if you have any questions um, uh, as well, and uh, yeah, um, on to see what you can expect from that. With that, this is Atul, um, and we'll, we'll look forward to see you in this class. Take care, and bye for now.